shader basic parameters rollouts. So let's go up to our material editor. So I'm going to come up to rendering and go to my material editor and go to my compact material editor. You can see in my top rollout here I have what's called the shader basic parameters. And if I hit the down arrow here I have various shaders. And I have eight different shader. So you're saying what is a shader? A shader is how uh, the light effects happen. So it actually calculates the effects of the of the lights. And we have four basic uh, settings we can check here. Um, and the first one is wire. And this is used, when we check this, this is the render the material as wireframe. And then we also have, if we check two-sided, this applies materials to both sides of a selected face. So if we have a face of something, we can have the material on both sides. The face map is to apply maps and images to each face on the object. So this is if we're putting images or a map on each face of the object. In faceted is used in in a rendering. Uh, we're going to show it the different facets or the little sections of the object, the faceted sections of the object, each little uh, uh, you know, increment of the of the 3D object is the facet, and so uh, so for a wireframe, we got to have this one checked. Um, and if we're gonna uh, do the face map on some sort of uh, uh, mapping or an image, face map, and also the faceted part uh, is right here. And we got to note that the facet checkbox, the effects are only going to be after rendering. So after rendering. And so for the face map and the face uh, faceted one, uh, we're going to need to assign an image or a map to the object. So we're going to go through and look at each one of these sh uh, shaders in individually. So we're going to take a look at those shaders, we're going to pick them, and then we're going to take a look at all the different parameters. But this is the basics. We start with which shader do we want, and then we have these unique situations here if we need to do things like wireframe or two-sided of an object, etc. So this is our sh shaded basic parameters, and I can also get that if I come over here to my uh, main toolbar, go to my material editor, again, shader basic parameters.